stop recording. Yeah, there we go. So, okay. Hi, guys. Uh, it's a late start because I did some singing today. It is 7.20 p.m. on uh, 8-7-2024. It is Skycat Live! What's up, guys? Uh, got, uh, playing some Seven Days to Die with Beg On. Um, I was on stream, but I didn't record until now because, uh, you know, I was singing. And so now uh, we will be recording the session in its entirety. And um, I, I just have to drop it off the big face. Sorry about that. I'm just getting around to everything that we're doing. I didn't realize that my face was still big. I'm terribly sorry I'm fixing it. Oh, you love my big fat face anyways. So, what do I do? I, I want um display capture. He, he's distracting me and it's hard for me to pay attention. Deactivate scene. Activate. There, there we go. Okay. Okay, sorry, I fixed the problem. Oh, wait, no. Did I? Yeah, yeah, I did, I did, I did. Yeah. Found an easier way to do the shooting range. Oh, yeah, what's that? Just pop over here and pop them. Yep. Then they have to go through the gate and they can't. <laughs> yep. We've had to do the shooting range so many times, it's good to come up with strategies. Uh huh. Doesn't cover the roof, but you see, this just made that entire thing a joke. I like the sound of this gun, but boy, it reminds me of Counter-Strike from like 2001. <laughs> oh, doggy. Not anymore. I got all of the, the loot room. Okay, I'm hitting the rooftop right now. That would be the the local populace, anyways. Yep. The very quick and easy quest. God, I can't wait till they, they make it so we can do this in a medieval setting. It's gonna be so fucking sweet. Okay, so we gotta burn the village. We gotta, you know, ra no, 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 no. Uh, we gotta. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, you, all this nasty medieval stuff will be very fun. We could we could take people slaves. You know? Don't forget, give grape juice to all the women. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's coded language. Uh, <laughs> I know it is. You, well, you come over to me. I'm gonna drop you a drone. A drone. Okay. A level five drone. Oh, nice. Yeah. Probably has an extra augment slot versus what you've got. More space. I am totally full up. If you've got room, I'm going to oh, start figuring what I can drop. Oh, you, oh, that's the drone. Okay. Yes, that is the drone. Do have my minor set. And I need you to take that arrow stick. But yeah, that locked box is full of shit, so. This other drone was dark green, but this one's yellow. Well, you can color your drone. It doesn't matter what color they are. They just come with a color. Sweet. I, I like that. Yeah, you don't get a drone in me medieval times. Ooh, this was a, ooh, cripple one mod. That's good because I lost my last one in the M60 that I lost. And I was like, oh, my DPS is a little bit worse. I'm going to modify and stick this uh, cripple one mod. Oh, no, you can't modify the AK with a cripple mod, huh? What about the sniper rifle? There's some good shit in the front of the store, too, oh. if you have the inventory to pick it up. That is a pistol thing. Okay, good shit. Where, where, sorry? The front of the store, like okay. where the sales counter is. I don't mean where we started, I mean like where oh, you are. Where I am, okay. Yes, the gun safe you mean? 
Uh, like I said, the sales counter has a lot of stuff in it, too. Oh, it does? Okay. Oh, there's ammo in the sales counter. I didn't know. Yeah, those... The sales racks that have, like, the guns and the armor on them, they have a very good chance at having decent stuff. Yeah. Which, they kind of did. I put the drone down on the ground. Ground. Oh no. What did you do, a dumb? I don't know. Oh, I, I no. I I think I know where I placed it. I'm fairly sure. Let me go look. But I put a drone down over there, I guess, and I thought it would just take off and, and fly. Oh, it did. There. No, it's it's following me. I'm good. I just didn't see it for a second. I was like, because it was behind me. Um, there we go. Four uh, minor sets. And I guess I scrapped this drone, do I? I mean, unless if you're going to invite anyone else to the server, you yeah. probably should. Well, I'm just scrapping it. I just didn't know if you needed it for something. Or... I got my own level five. No need for that one. Yeah. box of magazines. Just a second, I'm reading some texts here. Yeah. Just turn in your quest and see if there's one to the east, oh, though, yeah, to match closing. mine. Yeah, I might not have enough time. You got two oh, in-game hours. Two hours since I thought it was 20. Mm. Well, Shotgun Weekly, work. it's a... I'm just crafting it. Scope 8x, weapon flash mod, schematic, mechanical parts. Or crafting skill mag gun, I'll just gonna take that. Um, uh, we have four that are, well, three that are within acceptable range a restore power, a fetch clear, and a fetch clear. The fetch clears are both 517 meters west. So well, I'll if you don't have any east, then just pick the best west one. But yeah, I want to hit mine next, though. So, so there's Pete's Outlet or uh, Joe's Junction. Do you have a preference? Nope. All right, we'll take it. Actually, I was thinking actually Joe's Junction might be best because that sounds like a place with cars. Sorry, I think I probably. That doesn't really matter. All right, alternative chem bench has been set down, so if you ever need to craft anything. Oh, screamer in base. Oh, yeah, okay. It's in your trench. Uh, oh, nope, there it is. It's by the, the farming shit. Surprised there's not a second one there. Down to 200 rounds. I'll have to fix that. Oh, so uh, we, I, I think we made your fire to... around the base. By the way, you damaged up a bunch of columns. I did what now? You damaged a bunch of columns. Yeah, sorry about that. Uh, do you? Does it matter who produces the ammo? I can't remember. I have a slight increase in crafting speed, but not enough to really matter. Okay, so then. Um... But you do want to do the stacks, not the individuals, though. You get like 80. It's like 80% cost if you do the stacks. Okay. Um, 762. 
It requires... Can I make AP or are we too poor still? Well, we, we don't have our... Oh, our I, don't gun. Have, I don't have... We don't have sniper. production actually going yet is the problem. Yeah, and I, I need Sniper Volume 6, I guess. Uh, or that's what you need, I guess. Um, bullet tips, gunpowder, and bullet casing. Okay. You have casings over here, right? Ammo crafting. Right, over there. there. Bullet tips, casings. I need 762 casings. I don't think about the ammo. Bullet tip, bullet casing. Oh, good. We do have most of it except for the gunpowder, which is in resources, I think, right? Gunpowder, I've got an ammo and ammo crafting, which oh, is the other box over here. Yeah. I took the uh, gunpowder. Oh, no, I didn't. There we go. I got all the gunpowder we have. I think 1,100. How much of this would you be acceptable with me using? I don't care. We're going to have a ton of gunpowder soon because we've got it mass crafting right now. Yeah, this assault rifle has a lot of stopping power, but it chews up the metal. But, I mean, I went I went farming, so you know, that, that wouldn't be so bad. Of a, but we're a, also going to need to start putting brass into the smelters here soon. Oh, yeah, brass. Okay, I can yeah. make 369 rounds, which is good. Or no, I don't want to make, um, I want to make the uh, the pack of it, you said, the, the stack of 100. Box of 762. Yeah, that's what you want to make. Four boxes of 762, that'll reach 400. Yeah, that's not bad. Um, but I, I can't craft this, I guess. Or no, I have to put in the, the materials. Oops. So that that slows us down. You have a chopper. I, I I could probably do. I can probably do with this ammo. I'll just sit sniper. I just had a brilliant idea. Let's Why see. don't I put a storage box up here and put all the raw ingredient stacks in the storage box? Mm -hmm. oh, that's, uh... Basically, anything we're gonna smelt can go in the storage box here, so we don't have to go back and forth, back and forth, which will make it way easier to keep those things running. It says book. Like, I need sniper completion to, to even make a box of 762. I don't know if that's true. I'm just... It's, it's, it's sniper, you said? Yeah, it's sniper completion is what it says. It, uh, it won't tell me what rank. Uh, but, uh, yeah, it's sniper... Well, no, it's not a rank. You need uh, to get all seven books, and then it gives oh, you that last bonus for a set bonus. So you'll need I've to... got four out of seven books. I don't have sniper completed yet. Okay, so we can't even make 762, which is very bad. I'll have to switch weapons here to, like... Pistol, I guess, or well, not the mid 762. We can make the basic 762. Oh, we can? Oh, yeah, we do. I have all the mats for the basic, yeah. So, here, come make four boxes of. Uh, or come put in the. Oh, you, you can make that, can't you? No, no, I need a book. It says I need a book. It's it's, it's the AP you're talking about, no, man, isn't it? No, no, I'm, I'm talking about a box of 762. It, it's, it's, it's got a picture of a white book on the left side. And, it, and when I try to craft this, it takes me to a, a book that I need. Okay, I'll, I'll be right over Snipe, there. Sniper something. Yeah, you need sniper. Uh, in order to bulk craft all 762 ammo, you need um, the ribbon, which is all seven snipers. So I can't produce that. The base, the basic stuff, maybe I can. I can make the basic stuff, so I'll, make, I'll just... That way I don't have to... Um, I don't have to bother you. There we go. So now I have 369 rounds being made. That'll take half an hour. I just dropped some 760 for you on the ground. Oh, thank you very much. That, that I, would, I need to read text for just a moment, though. Oh, yeah, you're good. You're good. I'll put all this stuff back. Parts off that drone. I'm gonna start just keeping paper for you, I think. And cloth. I will put my new hair kits away. Put uh, iron. 
I just want to dump this in the box. Oh, there's m more gunpowder. Okay.
sensors have picked up something. No, my microphone was muted. I'm sorry, Big on. I'm back. Oh, yeah. No, I was muted. I was trying to talk to you. Sorry. Forgot that I muted for the phone call. Oh, you went north. Oops. I thought. I thought. Well, I, I I'm gonna run back to the base real quick because I, I brought the ammo crafting stuff by mistake and I'm gonna put it away. Oh, uh, you, uh, you probably didn't hear me, but you should unlock your truck. I'll unlock mine too. That way I can store on yours, you can store on mine. Okay, trucks on my truck's unlocked. And that way you can just stuff stuff in there if you need to. I'll leave it at the front of each uh, each monument we do. Okay, all set. Will starting the mission reset my truck somehow or do something to it? No, your vehicle's fine. Okay, so that I think I think the you should bring your truck closer maybe so you can dump loot in it, but whatever. Uh, I can't. I'm ready. I'm sorry. Well, you drug that motherfucker onto my jeep and now he's trying to attack it or something. I'm shooting him. Hold on, I just my mag was empty. Ooh, storage is so good. My complaints about this game are pretty much gone now. I didn't know the truck was that big of a storage. It opens my fucking mind about this game a lot more. Uh, it, it definitely makes the situation less shitty. Mm -hmm, definitely. You feel free to just stuff in mine, man. Alright, starting. This is your storage, too. Oh. Oh, I thought I heard footsteps from there. Nope. Oh, I did. I'm going to just draw a space above this wall here, because it should slow them down enough. Master, we are not alone. 
I woke him up. What is that? Special Tots aggro too, I think. I already pulled Special Tots. Oh, yeah, well, I heard something spawn there, I think. Oh, the turret. Yeah, duh. Oops. Sorry about that. Maybe I'd get a better position there. What if I can put it right here? No, not on your block. Oh, yeah, yeah, I would do it. There we go. There we go. Okay, I gotta turn on the front door. That's actually in a good position now. Oh, I broke your block, sorry. Oh, what is that? Screamer. Screamer. That's on me. Shit. Thank you. I didn't hear a scream, so we're probably... Yeah, I didn't hear it. Oh, my sound is, like, kind of down because I've, I've been mining. Oh, it. There we go. Okay. Hey, don't forget that bomb. Oh, that bomb. Yeah, that bomb. Yeah, yeah. So, I guess, fire in the hole? No, you're in there. I'll, I'll just wait. I don't think there's any reason to pop that. Yeah, I don't have the skills to. And because we're in a quest now, we can't just skip to the end without having to still clear everything. So, I think we go room by room, and this is a good time to learn how the theater works. I'll step on the mine sooner or later. On my way out, distracted or something. <sighs> There's a mine. <laughs> and there's a screamer screaming. Let's go find out where the bitch is. Ah, she's by the door. My senses have picked up something. What is that? A bathroom aggro? No, not Oh, screamer's down, but her horde is coming still. Alright, well. I went up the stairs. I'm gonna finish the monument. Oh, what spat at me? What the fuck was that? The fatty down here somewhere? That yeah, yep, there you are. Um, uh, yeah. Is this the path? I think it is. Right here. Oops. Okay. But I can't do anything. Looks like you can go straight down to the loop room here, but that would probably be suicide. I'll go down there. You want me to just jump down? No, you'll get fucking wasted. No, I That's won't. That's more You saw what the shit was last time uh, we came here. If I know it's coming, no, I won't. Nah, you'll get fucking wrecked by that. Just That'll be elevate the ceiling man. twice. I'm jumping down there. Enemies, just... I'm trying to get both of us quest rewards. Mm. The path is clearly over here. But I'm suicidal, big one. Come on. I like hugging these things. The one time where I still use my knife is fucking birds. Reloading. Incoming, incoming. I'll get the incoming if you can handle that bird. I'll try. Yeah, I got the bird. I think you deleted the bird. I don't know where that went. Is he dead? No. Die, you. That was way too many rounds. Die, you. There we go. I hazard to guess this is where some of that massive horde that attacked us came from. Yeah, they're coming. Oh, yeah. Right, I'm coming, too. Problem is, they're all running at you, so I can't get a shot. I love that drone. They didn't break it. I mean, oh, my brother got me. Ah, uh, so I got to get out of I got 32 rounds. I am good to go. Although I'm down to like 8 right now, but that's enough to clear this. Yeah, have, having 32 fucking slugs per clip is game changing. 
I because I can I can make it through a wave like that. Just triggered all the shit inside the place here. Okay, I got my turret and I'm coming back. I'm making him bash the doors. Yeah, like story. I'm coming. Yeah, right, right. I'm with you, but I got to trigger you. Okay. I got, I got all these idiots to line up in front of the doors. That's making it a lot easier. There you are. Yeah, good job. Yeah, as soon as they bust a hole in that door, it's just time to waste them. I thought damn, friendly fire was off, so I choked into the wall. I was like, no, I can't kill Bagon. I like jerked to the wall and I wasted like seven Yeah, I'm, I'm glad we don't have friendly <laughs> fire on yeah, this one. I mean, we were doing okay with it, but it's more more fun without it. Oh, that's been one of my favorite things about this server is not having to worry about friendly fire anymore. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I constantly hurt you. I think sometimes hurt you too, but it, it wasn't fun. It wasn't a fun mechanic. No, it's not a fun mechanic. Thing. Yeah, I'm really into like, is the mechanic fun these days, you know? I don't have to reload, so I'm fine. Yeah, but I have 32 rounds, so I can, I can keep going. Uh, down to four though, so reloading now. And back at it. Yeah, that's so many zombies. Oh, and there's more. Oh, push back up and block. Block, block, block. Close the door. Yep. Block, block the door. You're step back. Step back. No, there aren't that many. I got him, I think. Yeah, it's, it's fine. There aren't very many here. Alright, cool. And now there's no door. Yeah, it's just like two of them try to find their way up here. No, they're in the hatch. Oh, I see the hatch. I, I didn't realize it was there. Oh, I see. Hello there. I got something else from from the wife's ex. Well, he doesn't have it. Oh, there's zombies somewhere. That's quite a lot for the quest being over. I'm glad I put the, the fucking turret down. That hurts. Oh, I'm Is actually that... low. Yeah, I'm low too. I'm gonna go upstairs and I'm gonna block. Oh, I might go down. What the fuck? Oh, I block it, block it. I don't know. Just heal. I'll, I'll hold. I've got help. Reloading. No, I think that was finally it. Yeah, I think that, that was, was it. insane. It was. It was fun. Yeah. That was harder than anything. The turret in the was a fucking uh, uh, five head move. It was fucking sweet. It really had some fucking good value there. Actually, I feel good about myself. That thing just sprayed them the entire time. You know. Oh, we almost destroyed that ammo pile on the top. That would have been sad. Standing. Uh, 
I'm always on that. Ooh, what was in the big crate? Nice. All right, I am fully looted right now. Do you have room for all the shit or? Uh, yes, uh huh, I do. Oh, this uh, the lab of the boxes, okay. I like this place. It's so well built. Very interesting. Movie theater zombies would be a nightmare, you know? Oh, thank God. Okay, I think I... Oh, there's fucking more of them. Oh yeah, no, we we cleared the area. I think did we? No, I can't tell. Did we clear this? It That's says, fine. It says return to trader. It's done, but is it clear? I don't think it's clear. Drive me, drive me. You have a truck. I do, but you have a truck and it's two seater. Drive me, drive me. Oh, damn. But you have a truck and it's right there. I do, I'm not telling you what to do. You're fine. That's why I don't like the truck usually, but the inventory is just too much to pass up right now. Yep. This is such a man game. Mustard trucks and motorcycles, guns. Okay, yeah, so to finish what I was trying to say before the zombies interrupted me again, I, I just got a message from wife's ex-boyfriend that his, his daughter said at school that mommy has a boyfriend. Which so, is, you know, we, kind of, we made not, that assumption, we just didn't know if... Well, it was, it was a, uh, as far as I'm concerned, an unlikely but possible possibility it must be nice to have a vagina and have some dude just give you 10 grand i have never given women money like that and i, and I just must be nice you know i'm surprised just, it's not more than that by now right like 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 I, like I just couldn't imagine someone handing me 10 grand because i was a woman i don't know you know I'll probably found some if it, if that is what it is because no idea if that's actually true or not this is at this point little girl saying something and She's getting more reliable every day, but not enough reliability. Uh, but yeah, if it's if it's true, it's like what the fuck. And that he's just if it is a boyfriend, I, like she's still married. She just separated. A very valid point. It's infidelity, in the in the legal sense of the term. If I was going through the divorce that you guys were going, I would be like, oh, God, like, sex is be out of the question right now, you know? Or love or any of that stuff. I would just take care of my business. You know? well, yeah, I mean, Family obviously, first. I'm not looking for someone while I'm with my parents. I'm still. not talking about you. I'm talking about her. 
I'm talking, hey, I'm not I'm talking just, about you. Talking. You you I, could go have sex have a, right now. I have a very strict rule that I need to go lose the weight before I, I start seeking a woman. And like if someone right. approaches me, I'm not going to say, be gone, foul beast. But no. I, I am not looking for someone and will not be until I lose weight. Yep. Or, and also the court case should probably be over. Well, I'm sure hoping it's over by then, but yeah. no idea, because this woman is a master of stalling. Okay, so what now? Ooh, the moon looks awesome. I love living in a digital world. It's so fun. Did those bullets ever finish? Or did you move them? Half of them are done. Okay, I'm set and ready for anything if there's anything. Yeah, it's all good if not. Oh, right now, I think we're. Oh, wait, you have a quest, don't you? I think so. No, we did my quest. Er, yeah, we did my quest, didn't we? Oh, no, that was your quest. Oh. So, no, we haven't done mine now. Okay, tier four oh, I'm about to run off to yours. Alright. Like, ah. Actually, I gotta, I gotta check something on my email here. I'll need a minute. That's all good. I didn't put everything away. Oh, because the dump box is full. Ah, I hate loot. Okay. Pretty fun to sing for three and a half hours. Pretty fun. I love not being on YouTube. Stupid censorship. The drone doesn't exist, it's just this floating entity that doesn't have any. First aid or first aid kits in case the drugs break out of us. I guess I can do a first aid kit. Oh, yeah, actually, I might need to. This won't take super long, but I might need to dig through. So, here, get out of your truck, put the truck in your pocket, and I will drive. And it, no, it's, not, my it's not that. I need to focus for oh. a few minutes. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, I need to focus for a few minutes. I I need to get a document or two together. Yeah, it's, it's it, it won't take super long, but I'll need a few. I'm not in a rush, buddy. We're good. I'll watch Kamala's speech. <laughs> yeah. Damn yeah, it, you're distracting me. But uh, you saw she, she picked fucking Tampon Tim as her running mate. <laughs> yeah, I heard he has a DUI. Did you, hear the, did you hear this? Did you get this? Well, I mean, he's putting... Taxpayer provided tampons in eighth eighth grade boys restrooms, so mm. uh, nothing surprises me with That'll that. Help yeah. He's Don't... a fucking lunatic. <laughs> I 
<laughs> Look at this shit. Like it's it's positive positive reinforcement. If you can be positive and make people smile and laugh and be like get them cheering and stuff, you can do anything at all. You can do anything at all. The muggles will follow you and do whatever you need. It doesn't matter. You just have to actually do it. You have to like you have to like get up on stage. You have to be like, I want to lead you. Hi guys, I love you. How are you? How are you? Do you guys work here? What's the big fucking export in this town? And you're gonna hear you're gonna hear uh uh steel and it, like oh okay so it's steel huh yep and then and then uh anything else and they're like yeah mining <laughs> and then you get the you get the last mining okay okay it's not that hard it's not that hard the, the, the problem is that they seem to like try to draw this weird line between like what's real and what isn't Look at that smile. Winning. And yes, you dirty loser. You dirty loser, Democrat. This campaign, Governor Tim Walz. Got a hit, Kamala. And as you <laughs> just, just heard, and the Minnesotans here know, Tim has an incredible record as governor. She just looks of the like a prosecutor. Minnesota. Fucking hate prosecutors. I actually don't hate them. I just. And to those who know him best, Tim is more than a governor. To his wife, Gwen, he is a husband. To his kids, Hope and Gus, he is dad. To his fellow, fellow veterans, he is Sergeant Major Wall. Yeah, Sergeant Major. To the people of... Oh, he's a Sergeant Major. I didn't know that. Southern Minnesota for 12 years, he was a congressman. To his former do nothing congress high school students he was mr walls <laughs> mr balls and to his former high school football players he was coach coach will know Coach Walls by a new title, <laughs> Vice President of the United States of America. Yeah. E.P. Walls. E.P. Walls. Oh, it really is good to Look at the positive <laughs> reinforcement. Look at the positive reinforcement. So, listen, let me tell you, I am clear. The path Ah, oh, fuck, there's a little horde coming to our base. I'm gonna kill them quick. They're literally sprinting to our base. Okay. I think it's just a random wandering horde because he turned up the speed settings at night. They're all, like, fucking sprinting through the snow. There we go. Yeah, I'm, like, trying to sift and type through shit, and then I see a fucking horde of zombies sprinting across the snow. Okay. I'm back to doing my thing here. Oh. I'm putting this loot away. Oh. No, where is my motorcycle at? Oh. We are going to win. We are going to win. And I've been here many times, as you all know, recently and even before. And many of you know then 
Before I was elected vice president, before I was elected United States Senator, I was an elected attorney general, and before that, an elected district attorney. And before that, and before that, I was a courtroom prosecutor. So in those roles, I took on perpetrators of all kinds. Predators who abuse women, fraudsters who ripped off consumers, scammers who broke the rules for personal gain. So hear me when I say, I know Donald Trump tight. <laughs> I know oh. his type. In fact, I've been dealing with people like him my whole career. For example, as Attorney General of California, well, hold on, the, you know what? The courts are going to handle that part of it. What we're going to do is beat him in November. It's good to see some hope again on my people's faces. It's really emotional for me. It's good to see some hope on my people's faces. It's really emotional for me. It, it, it's, it's this thing about like... Tell you, as Attorney General, I took on one of... Like, if everybody's unhappy all the time and scared, it, it, it makes the place a shitty place to be. It does. It's not that America was ever not great. It's that of our country's largest. we got to stay positive. We, we have a lot of problems, and we did a lot of stupid things, and For profit like any country, and we, we just, you know, we got to be positive. Colleges that scam students. Well, Donald Trump ran a for-profit college that scammed students. Yep. As a prosecutor, I specialized in cases of sexual abuse. Well, Donald Trump was found liable for committing sexual abuse. As Attorney General, I held... Look, she can actually be like, he was convicted of sexual abuse. Like, she shouldn't have to talk much. She can just be like, you know what his situation is. Big Wall Street banks accountable for fraud. Well, Donald Trump was just found guilty of fraud. 34 counts. So in this campaign, I'll tell you, I will proudly put my record against his any day of the week. I think, uh, like, really, this is such a scam artist, fucking bad actor, that honestly, anybody with a real job can kick his fucking teeth in. He's, he's been a joke his entire life, living meme. Anybody with some actual credentials will kick his fucking teeth in. The man is a fucking living cartoon character. His life is a joke. There's... So it was, I mean, his television show wasn't a joke, but and his life wasn't a joke. But it's, it's, it's his he, his life was sponsored. He was sponsored. He never had to worry about anything ever. Well, I don't know what they. I don't like. Well, I look at America that's struggling, and I don't know why a sponsored person would be the right choice to run America right now. I want somebody who's actually worked their whole life. But let's make no mistake. This campaign. Like I have more of a fucking legitimacy than Donald Trump. I've worked more than him. I was a taxi driver for 13 fucking years. That's what I would say on the podium if I was trying to be president. I'd be like, yep, I worked I worked 13 years taxi, 60-hour weeks for 13 years, something like that. And it was, it was just crazy. It was, you know, it just kept going. And I feel like I worked. I don't feel like he worked. It's not just about us versus him. I feel that my say is more valid. Donald. Like, and if it's not work, then look at his actual record. It's about two very different visions for our nation. Yeah. Two very different visions. One, for us, focused on the future. Yeah. The other, focused on the past. Yep. And Wisconsin, we, we here, we fight for the future. We fight for a future where every worker has the freedom to join a union. Please. We need a Hoffa. Please be Hoffa. Union strong. Union strong. 
Union strong. Union strong. We fight for a future where every senior can retire with dignity. <laughs> Union strong. Union strong. A future where we build a broad-based economy and one where every American has the opportunity to own a home, to start a business, to build wealth. And get an education and, and some mental health care and a little bit of help. A little bit of social help with daycare, and that kind of thing. In this fight. Yeah, maternity leave, a little bit of social help. Some people need social help. They can't do this alone. Like me, I can't do this alone. As Tim Walls likes to point out, we are joyful warriors. Joyful warriors. Joyful warriors. We're joyful warriors. We're joyful warriors. Because That's a good way to put we it. We know that while fighting for a brighter future may be hard work, hard work is good work. Hard work, Hard work is, is good work. work. Thank God you're willing to do so, it. I wasn't. We will continue to fight for affordable housing, for affordable health care, affordable yep. child care. You guys have been fucking us for leave. too long. You've been fucking us for too long. Yeah. And paid leave. Get a little bit of social help. You know, and not feel guilty about it like you're some kind of fucking... You know, some kind of sycophant. Nah, every human being in this country can be can have three square meals, and we would still have trillions of dollars. Every single fucking human being in this country could have three square meals and a place to sleep and a car and transportation and a nice life and mental health care and doctors and all that stuff, and we would still have trillions and trillions left after. And we, I'm not saying that we need to rob the the bank of the USG or whatever. I'm saying that. With the help, the people will pull themselves out of the gutter and, 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 and just basically make the lower class them not exist. That's what it was like in the, sort of in the 50s. There almost wasn't a lower class, not really. There was always, There's always been ghettos, but, you know, it, it's just like, I don't know. Like, I, I feel like ever since poverty because of the, the rich people stealing sort of became like the norm. Uh... We believe in a future where we lower the cost of living for America's families so that they have Yeah, like 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 I didn't hear any presidents talk like in the last like I don't I don't think Obama talked much about actually solving like much except for the health care. He went after the health care like with a with a with a vengeance and he made sure that it got done. And it blew our mind when suddenly we weren't paying for doctors anymore. And I was like, that's it. That's that's all the stuff you guys need to do. We have so much money. We have so much money. I'm not saying give it to the fucking poor. I'm saying just make sure that there's not any poor anymore. Make sure that they have, uh, you know, a play. Like if, if, if you can't afford three to five hundred dollars a month for rent, then the, then the city should should subsidize your housing. I really feel that way. Americans. And I'm not talking about socialism, really. I'm talking about support. It is support. Americans need support. They uh, they can't do this all alone. And and I don't know. And I don't see most people talking about this kind of thing. I heard Joe talk about that. And they're not dumb. They, they've seen now the error of their ways. And they've seen, they've seen that we'll just rebel against them. We don't care. We'll fucking burn them. We don't care what it does to the country. We'll burn them. You can't treat us like this. This poverty is disgusting. There are hookers living in motel rooms and people living on the streets and, you know, there's all this terrible shit going on in this country. There's all these gangs and all, these, all this stuff. If people were able to just pursue whatever their fucking life's passion was and not have to worry about where the next fucking day's rent's going to come from or something, they don't have that kind of stress in their life, I think you'd be surprised what, what, you know, what people are capable of. And I, bre I believe in the, the notion of power, uh, power of as opposed to power over. I think the Republicans are into power over things. I think of I think of it as power of things. It's not just to get by, but to get ahead. Like I, I, I think every single like like dream dreamer in this country, like you know the the kids that came in as dreamers and stuff. I think all of them should just by rogue get a place. I think they should get a place. I think they should be taken care of. I don't know where that money comes from. We're kind of poor. But, I mean, like, that's the first thing that the government needs to actually be retroactive about, or, you know, like, I'm sorry, be uh, proactive about is, uh, is, is addressing the poverty. And I don't know what they do to solve it, but I know that if every fucking human in this country had a $300 car and a $300 apartment 
and running water and three square meals a day because the food isn't goddamn horrible and it's not you know it's it is and it's actually high quality and all that and and as long as all of the american all the americans have the 10 basic things which is like rent food water security uh uh help aids essentially aids right and and um and all the other things that that, that the raising kids you know successfully requires and we have that we do have that but we don't have it well enough we all know that you can't pull yourself up off nine grand a year that's that is not even a living wage that is that is just and i'm not saying give every american like 50 grand i'm saying make sure that their meals are are are, are actually taken care of with food stamps make sure that their rent is actually subsidized so if they're willing to do any work at all like at all at all they can have a house if they're not then okay go be homeless we're not telling you that you have to work this is not a this is not a totalitarian thing but you know it's not a totalitarian idea that every human should have food water shelter love tlc mental health care i think all of the school shootings and all the problems and all the hatred and all the racism stuff is actually systemic problems from from things in in, in these people's personal lives that they didn't have systemic racism and they didn't have systemic poverty and they didn't face systemic jail and they didn't face like torture kind of they weren't frowned on by the community or frowned on by providers because they have weaknesses or anything like that. They're just treated like a doctor's patient and they're loved and they're taken care of like what the, the navigating the American healthcare system did recently, you know? Uh, and I've been navigating the American healthcare system. I saw that I was loved. I was loved. Obama succeeded with what he did. Now, I'm not pro-Democrat, actually. It's kind of crazy. I'd be okay if their party died. But I do think that they succeeded here. I think the infrastructure actually kind of did go out. I think the, the health care did go out. And the people are actually trying to help us now, even with that do-nothing do Congress. Because while our economy is doing well by many measures... It's not good. Prices for it's everyday not good. things like... I'm terribly sorry, guys. I'm going to go get, um, I'm just stepping away for just a sec. Uh, okay. I'm close to done, too. Yeah, I'm just getting a drink. The gas, the groceries, the rent, the food, the water, you've been letting the fucking conglomerates price fix war against the lower and the middle class for like 60 years. And it killed us. It did. Like everything in the, in the country is too expensive now. Nobody buys anything. Nobody has anything. And it's like, and it's like weird. It's weird. If you want America to, 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 to succeed, pick other countries to fuck with. Don't fuck with your own country, you know? Don't fuck with your own country and try to make things hard. Try to make it hard for them to get abortions or any of that stuff. It's just, like, don't fuck with, don't fuck with people. Just give them their fucking freedom. That's all the government's really necessarily for, for the government to do. That's all that's necessary for the government to do is, is just to treat people equally, and that's it. That's all. It's not hard. Eventually, all of our politicians will look like her, and that's a good thing. You know, kind of sick of seeing suits all of my life. I want to see something else. You know, when I was attorney general, I... Man, she's rocking that pantsuit hard. She's, she's, she's got the, the Hillary pantsuit. <laughs> I went after Basically just Hil Hillary Clinton, but Indian. Yeah, and there you go. It's, like accents. Yeah, see, like, I, I like that she's being positive and saying positive things about infrastructure and all this stuff, like the Democrats always do. I like their message. But then I remember the CFR and the trilateral and, <laughs> and who these people actually are. And I'm like, no. And when I am president... I don't really like prosecutors. They fuck with me kind of too much in my life. 
you know, for me to really like respect what she does. I think it's cool that we have DAs and prosecutors and we need them for the system. And I think they're honorable people. I think she's an honorable person, kind of. But like, yeah. She's not an honorable person. What the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, let's, uh, let's see. Yeah. She literally spent her career as a prosecutor locking up black men for nonviolent marijuana offenses and yep. putting them in prison camps so they could work slave labor for California. This is, yep, and, and he's absolutely right, and this is why I don't like prosecutors. I, like, I don't think what she brags about is actually something something to brag about. Like he said, you know. He, don't forget, she also thinks that the cloud is a real cloud where we store our files. <laughs> yeah. yeah. This is a, a brilliant scholar we're dealing with. She's on the, the level of that fucking black Supreme Court justice that Biden put in, the one that can't define what a woman is. <laughs> Her sure. name's escaping right now, but yeah, she was getting questioned by Congress, and she literally could not define what a woman was. Yeah, a, I mean, adult human female. Yeah, adult human female with a womb, you know. Well, it's because she, she was trying to skirt the trans thing, but if you as a Supreme Court justice can't define what a woman is uh, because of, of Tumblr arguments. Mm -hmm. No, she's not a, she's not legitimate. No. Oh, uh, Kitanji. That's it. Uh, Kitanji. This is why I'm progressive. I know they're lying. I like her and I like that. She's got a smile on her face and she doesn't seem to want to fight some tribalist fight, you know, but she still is like really establishment. Really? Re we're talking like the people who actually did put all these people on the streets. These people are on the streets because they went to jail. You know, once you go to jail, you can't you can't re rejoin community. So what do you do? You go to you go down you go down you go down to the fucking skid row, and uh, and and uh, Kamala prosecutes you while you're down there. You know, <laughs> and I'm sorry, but he's right. I mean, I, 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 he is right about that. I mean, I like that he stepped with a legitimate complaint because because out of the Republicans lately, I've just heard like Kamala bashing just in general. I always wonder what their complaint actually is. He stepped with a good one. I've got lots of complaints. It's just which one do you want to shoot? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Prosecutors often drink too much. They often cheat on their spouses. They often wheel and deal with their jobs. They're often guilty of blackmail and stuff like that. I don't really trust prosecutors too much. You know, they're they're, they're okay people. They're they're civil servants and they're doing their jobs and they're protecting us. And I like that we have them. I'm not saying what they do is evil. I'm saying that they can tend to be sort of evil. They they, they tend to be the people in the back rooms dealing. You know, that that whole the the, the veritable cliche about backroom dealing, that's about lawyers. That's the lawyers that they're talking about. You know, the lawyers cut. Fuck you. Ask my friend beg on. Take my wife, please. Are lawyers bad? No. I, I would actually go past the bar myself just so I don't have to pay them anymore. Would it go past the bar, big on? <laughs> I don't have to pay for divorce lawyers anymore. I was thinking when my parents pass, I will grow grapes on this property. My stepfather, it's his, his, his shit. I can't tell him what to do with his land, but when they pass, I, I believe I will grow grapes. Sell grapes. Grow some good grape, grapes out here. Good tulips, too. Could grow some tulips, make some money there. Flowers are expensive. They price fix the diamonds, they price fix the chocolate, they price fix the oil. And this is both the Democrats and the Republicans here that we're talking about. They're, ne they're both guilty of it. They, they're, in, they're in some price fixing war of anything that humans like. They just saw that there was an opportunity and they raised the price of it, you know? Even, okay, I'm even, back in playing. Even cancer meds. Yep. Like Martin Screlly. They Martin screlly the world. Gasoline, childcare, diapers, food, water, 
cl good, clean, healthy food that's cheap. That's that's like a myth. That, that's like a myth now. It's all dollar chalupas and stuff like that. And so if, I, I wish she would talk a bit more. She is talking a bit about price fixing. I'm glad that they're at least waking up to it. It's all bullshit and pandering, though. We know she doesn't care. She does not care. Pandering. She does not care about that. That, that is, he is right about that. She does not care. She does not give two shits about. At least when Trump says the something, there's a good chance he's going to follow through on it, like or yeah. hate what he's saying. Yeah, he, one thing you can never say about Trump is he, he he doesn't like you know. Well, he did fail, but he didn't fail on purpose, you know. He wasn't a perfect he, he, president. He's, he's no an earnest. Perfect. No, no president's perfect. Like he's an earnest president, and he means what he says when he says things. You know, Bagon is right about that. What's the word for this? Uh, he's not disingenuous. You know, he, he when he says things, he usually means it, even if it is crazy. He says things that are exaggerations, and if you're intentionally misinterpreting what he says, then you're an idiot. yeah, you could, you could quote him wrong. But I mean. It was I mean, hard the first right, couple literal of years. Quotes, be wrong. Yeah, we didn't know who he was the first couple of years. We didn't know that he's sort of dumb and, and a little bit crazy, you know? We didn't know. So we just didn't know how to react to all that stuff, you know? But after a couple of years, we were like, oh, yeah, he is definitely like a television star that's sort of vacuous and likes drama. He definitely likes, you know, he is, he is definitely like that. I like drama. What's wrong with him? I don't, I don't I'm, I'm not I'm nothing. As long as I'm not part of the drama, it's fun. it's usually fun to watch. Yep. Uh, uh, dude, my, my career is drama. You know? Just tracking the drama like Asmongold. Stupid. Like fucking, you know, Doc, uh, Dr. Disrespect or uh, fucking Cody Ko or any of this stupid shit. That, all the child molestation fucking streamer stuff. So stupid. Track all that stuff. I watch Tom Dark. <laughs> like religiously. Because Tom Dark is actually so funny. Start her up. All right. Just trying to get some cars looted. I should be wearing my scavenger set, but I'm not. Damn, your driver just does like one shot those things. That's two shot. Yeah. All right, let's go. What the fuck was that? Something over there. Over there being relative. Oh. I'm watching your back here. Oh, it's a white. That's oh, what it was. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's a white in the wall. Oh, the yeah. He lost his legs. He did. I don't follow you because I'm, like, listless. I follow you because I'm a cameraman. I like watching I, you loot. You know? So one of the things I always thought was funny in DDO was they have a l very large, one of their more notable dungeons. Like, yeah, I remember those dungeons. dungeons. Yeah, they were it, great. It's called Dalera's Graveyard. Yeah. And there's a disproportionate number of like ethereal shadow skeletons mm. and whites in that series of dungeons. Mm. And Ooh. one of my favorite things to say to people was there's more whites in Dalera's Graveyard than a clan rally. It's one of those funny, inappropriate things to get a reaction from people. Oh. Snakes on a whatever. If I wasn't whatever. in the, the zombie apocalypse at the moment, I would have laughed. I, I'm just bad at jokes in general. I'm autistic. I'm bad at jokes. I have a different sense of humor than anybody else I know. It's got to be, it's got to be random and it can't be scripted. Think chaotic neutral. <laughs> So like people, people like for instance, my ex, she really gets disappointed that she can't like make me laugh with one-liners. And I'm like, no, just show me memes and she'll make me crack up. But one-liners, no. Ew. Live music, cold drinks. Good advice. Making us dig through the dungeon, it looks like. Yeah. This is a very weird dungeon so far. You know, we have a pretty good duo co op game, and they're saying that there's a really good co op game we're buying called. Um, oh, I lost the title, I just had it. Um, I'll, I'll think of it. 
but it's uh you, you have cameras and there's some dude trying to kill you and like you and your friend have to like figure out like what to head what to do in five seconds you have like five seconds to think what to do and it's supposed to be a really good game i kept the battery is no it's not battery's not included what is it it's um ah uh, what's the streamer game it's a streamer game and it has a big streamer following i can't think of it it's on, it's gonna be on the top 20 i'm gonna go look Kind of like those games where you have to be in the ship together and you have to co-op, you know, make sure that you survive kind of thing. Uh, well, you didn't want to play Voidborn when I, I brought it up to you. I didn't, no. I was, in the end, I realized I didn't. But this one's like a gun game, and you have like five seconds to pretty much kill the guy who's going to kill you, I think. And it's totally a different premise, it's, it, but, but it looks good to me. Nope, never mind. Th this game has dropped down the list so far that it was a flash in the pan. But it was really big there for a couple of months. Yeah, a lot of them end up being flashes in the pan. Yeah. They, comes, they come back sometimes. Oh, yeah. Updates and stuff. I mean, yep. uh, Deep Rock Galactic was, I was always well received. Yeah. I mean, honestly, that's a game I wouldn't mind playing just because I fucking love dwarves. I love DRG. Yeah, but I just didn't want to play it alone. Or I do want to play it alone. That's the problem. It's definitely not a game designed to be played alone. Nope. But it's such a good game, though. I like procedurally generated, like Rust. It's only a few games like Rust, and DRG is one of them. kind of panic earlier because I realized there was an email from my attorney's paralegal asking me for my feedback on a temporary parenting plan to get established. Ooh, and I realized I hadn't my responded language. to her. It completely had gone over my head that she had sent that email in the chaos of the, the hearing that I had right. last week. Yeah. Oh, yes, I would like my kids oh, back, please. I please, was, please stop I was holding replying my to that and, like, some... giving her a copy of my, my parenting plan with my son to yeah. use as, like, a, a basis. Oh, holy shit. That book pile, it had the vehicle plow schematic. Yay. Yeah, it reduces sure. damage taken when objects hit in front of the 4x4, increases damage to blocks and entities. It'll catch a cow. So, very glad I just got that. That was that was one of those big hit lists. Okay, so we can go down the stairs. Can we go up to? I always want to go up first because I know there's an end to up. I never know how far down Here's this is. There's a go. hatch right here. Oh, I'm on the oh, I'm on the rooftop right now. I'm just checking it out. Looks like we definitely have to go down though. I don't see shit up here. Yeah, I think it's down. I'm at, I'm at it. It's at me. It was um that light. Uh, I'll come back so you can find it. It's like. Oh, sorry, I'm just getting up the ladder. I'm standing up. Oh, you're already down there. But yeah, I was important I said that, but also I I thought there was something preventing my wife from leaving the school district. And that's something that's always put in place as part of a parenting plan. You know, you oh, can't wow. leave the state or leave the school district. <laughs> you have to submit notice to the other party, give the other party a chance to object, all that kind of shit. Well, in the decent likelihood that she might actually have a fucking boyfriend somehow, no idea how the fuck how, but if she actually does, then what if she fucking moves like an hour away as soon as she has to get out of my house? That's what they do. That's what they do. Yeah. That's... So that's what I that's what I need to prevent. Yes. So I, I had to make sure I messaged my attorney's paralegal and CC the attorney, but she's still on vacation for another like two weeks. You won't have to do the driving, but you'll end up doing the driving because she won't and you'll have to yeah. do it. Yeah, there'll be driving. I, I don't want any of that shit. I don't want her moving away. I want my daughter to be close at hand and all that shit. Yep, she, for, for these 18 years, her life is forfeit, you know? Yeah, so. Well, if it's... If she tries to leave the school district, I can, I can complain and say no. And they should, at the very least, for the duration of the, the custody fight that we're going through, they should sustain my objections. So, like, you know, you're not allowed to move until we're done figuring out what's happening to you. I mean, when I was dating her, 
I was giving her a full-on house, you know, or letting her live in a full-on house, you know, like taking her into my life with everything I have. And her ex still managed to get an objection pushed through to where she wasn't allowed to move in with me. That's insane. That's how deep this goes. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, so if, like, he was able to prevent an ex-girlfriend, not spouse, uh, from, from moving, what was it, like 20 minutes north? <laughs> but I should definitely be able to prevent her from moving because she, she it was de she was denied her request to move, and she moved anyway and was found in contempt for it. There's this funny line in um in, in Trailer Park Boys, where where, where uh, Julian looks at uh at, at, at um Ricky and he's like, no, you're not getting married because you'll end up getting a divorce and you lose half your shit and that's not happening because. All of the shit that you own is ours. <laughs> that, was, that was so funny. It is true. Everything Ricky owns is kind of Julian. So if if some woman, if he marries some woman and she gets a divorce, then all, like and then basically your friends are just basically paying for it. You know. Well, there is this thing called a prenup, which at this I love point I'm going to have to insist on. I actually proposed to a friend of mine named Lucky. I was like, Lucky, I will marry you. She was like, I'm Mexican and I want to come to America. I was like, I'll marry you if you get a prenup, you know? Because she's awesome. She's, she's actually a really good fucking Rust player, Fortnite player. I love my friend Lucky, but she's too young for me. But I did actually make an offer. I was like, I will marry you if you sign a prenup. She didn't know what it was. And I was like, never mind then. If you don't know what it is, just forget it. <laughs> just forget it. I'm not making the offer anymore. <laughs> why that would be a problem if she yeah. doesn't know what a prenup is that level of ignorance if you don't know what a prenup is then then i'm obviously probably taking advantage of you or something i'm just gonna not do this and that's literally what i said i think it's funny it's Using... pretty easy to explain it's just yeah. something where if you break up it sets the the it sets certain things so you don't have to worry about it going a bad way in court and that can be for both people's protection one of the funny things that divorce lawyer says on that video I linked to you is he's like, I just uh, I can't really stop. Uh, oh, I don't know. I'm looking for my 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 uh, my satchel right now. Actually, I can't find it. It's like by the stairs, but it's in the wall. It, but when I go out to look, there's like open air where where it says the satchel is. There's just open air. Oh wait, maybe I think I see it actually. Oh, did I take a spray? Where is this? Why does it say... Oh, it's in the ground. Why is it in the ground? Oh, okay. It's in the basement, I guess? Oh, it was. It was in the basement. Oh. oh, if zombies if zombies came, I would die. <laughs> there was no way I would... Maybe I can box out. Nope, not damn courier satchel. Oh no, I have to go out the front. I hate going out the front. Well, right now we got a loot room. And I know there's a bunch of zombies that drop down there, but they haven't come down yet. Apparently you can in the- oh, there they come. They're coming. I sure, I sure hope I can get some assurance that she's not going to be able to fucking move an hour away or some shit like that. She will. She will. Oh, she might do. very well try. <laughs> oh, hey, a swimmer followed you. <laughs> See, my sleigh tracker is saying we have to go in the elevator, but it is locked. Oh, there we go. That's, it's only two of them, I'm fine. 
I mean, they're both strong, but yeah, so that's the quest. Now, now we get loot. I do think I heard another screamer, though, so I would be surprised if there's not a, another screamer about to Ooh, come in. Ooh, that was damn near my death. Nice. Looks like you got good health to me. Yeah, it, um, the roof collapsed in, like that marquee, uh, and I just happened to be sprinting, so I didn't catch a catch death, but it was close. Alright, I need you to come help me loot. Maybe watch this room if you come in here. I think there might be others. Um, got it? Oh, and now I'm full, but I'll just go dump in the truck, I guess, right? Don't we have a direct, like, connection to the front door? I don't know. Uh, yeah, we do. Nice. I'll have to open it, but... I'm gonna go dump in the truck real quick. Actually, I was able to grab everything that's valuable, so... Oh, you got it all, huh? Okay, there's a bear outside this front door, and I'm almost through. Did you just you come get up the your satchel? Yeah, I'm like, where the hell is the exit from this place? It must be the Here, stairs. Like, right up the stairs, I, I have an exit. Just come to me. Yeah, where are you? Like, Yeah, like, right here, dude. Okay, okay. I'm so used to places having access. Oh, there's a bear. Yeah, he was right when I popped the block. He was standing there looking at me, and it was actually very comic. <laughs> I was like, okay, hello. <laughs> Where's my... Oh, yeah, back in. I don't have any inventory space, so I'm not going to bother cutting up that bear. Mm -hmm. um, I will get it. I just need to put the truck down. Okay, got it. Well, it's dark now, so if you want to do some dungeon board, I could switch to that. It's whatever, buddy, your call. I'm um, dealer choice. I'm just the. Uh... Well, let's let's hop on dungeon board after we All turn right. in, then, because I, I don't want to just focus only on seven days because we'll again run in through it too fast but but yeah also I, I think we should be giving some attention to seven days still Forge steel, armor oh, triple pocket today. mod, armor crafting kit 5, 250 concrete, and a polymer string mod. That's for bows. Yeah. I guess forge steel. There's a Shaka Messiah volume 6. I've already got my full Shaka Messiah set, so I don't need it. Uh, I have a choice of a beaker, a blade trap bundle, 10,000 dukes, a 4x4 four four parts bundle, or time yep, charge. The dukes are definitely better. Okay, 10,000 dukes, got it. And then, does it matter where I go? i oh, sorry, what, what quest we do? I don't think it really uh, matters. Let me see what I have first. Yeah, I've got 2 west, 1 east, 2 south. But the south ones are out of the... Re are, are off the table because they're between two all right i got one of the west that's uh tier five infested so that's actually pretty good I've got some that I envy you. Trader, I think. nothing better than putting the dead back in the ground i don't want to look I 
got a Lucky Luger Volume 7. Buy more medical supplies and loot. Grenades in these magazines. Okay, we have uh, 40, 42,000 dupes. Maybe I should look, look at the vendor real quick. Starting to get rich. Maybe I should buy ammo. What do you have? Damn, his eye is so messed up. Ah, the sweet smell of gunpowder. Bullet casings are cheap. That's probably worth doing. Robotic drone morale booster mod schematic. Well, I'm going to buy that. I hope the Zed heads get a full belly tonight on your sorry ass. I have a tier five for opening trade routes. Nothing better than killing Zed. Yeah, you should accept those. That'll tell you where I the traders actually are. For free, if I wasn't stuck running the shop, I've got enough firepower to start a war, or end one. Yeah, I bought bullet casings and buckshot because they're fucking cheap. There's a steel sledgehammer here, but I don't value it. Do you value robotic drone morale booster? It's not bad to have, but it's stamina regen, which isn't going to really help us at this point in the game. Oh, uh, yeah. Big hitters. Complete club crafting. Electrical traps. Armored up. Are you done with armor crafting? Yes, I am. Okay. I'm going to buy this for getting elixir just because it's you know, probable. And yeah, I thought that to pick those up. I think that's it. Oh, here's seven lock picks, but I don't want to pay for that. Forge steel. I'm going to buy those. There's a crucible here. Do you value that? Nope, we already got two. I wasn't planning on making a whole fuck ton of forges. You can make level six impact driver at some point, right? I could already make it now, but we need motorized tool parts, which I don't have. So, I'll, yeah, actually, always check for motorized tool parts. That's what I'm here for. I just couldn't remember what it was. Yeah, motorized tool parts are incredibly valuable. Motorized tool parts, lucky my eye open. Here's a shotgun auto turret that's probably better than whatever I'm using. Oh, and always buy the, the water purifier parts and then install them in one of the purifiers. Doesn't matter what, it's just literally find a purifier that needs it. Okay. We do need a lot of water for some crafting. It's not for drinking anymore, it's for crafting. Like making duct tape. Mm -hmm. Yes, we use water to make duct tape. You need cloth, huh? Yeah, we're short on cloth, but I wouldn't say buy it, because it's pretty plentiful when we do dungeons. Okay. Yeah, I don't really see too much. Here's a jar of honey. I'll buy that. Well, no, I don't need to buy that. Um, well, I think that's it. All right, oh, gunpowder. The... I'll buy gunpowder. That's cheap. Check the vehicle storage, but no, don't buy gunpowder. We have fuck tons of that. Oh, did we? I, I thought we were out. I, I, I only saw like 300 when I looked. Okay. 
Well, I just got 3,000 more. Okay, sweet. Oh, the water filter. Yep, here it is. Bought it. Yeah, buddy. But yeah, we have a good amount of gunpowder right now. And remember, the chem bench is constantly producing more, so we're going to continue to have lots of gunpowder. I got a uh, weighted head mod for my ratchet. Okay, more spoof. All these dump boxes, damn it. I'm gonna go install this water filter. Okay, install the water filter. I'm trying to get the dump boxes like like cleared here. Lockpicks, yay. Um, I got four machine gun parts. Oh, that's not what we're looking for, huh? Cooling mesh mod. Dump boxes are empty now. Oh, I just unlocked the ability to make a rocket launcher. Only tier one, but I can make it now. Yeah, I want a rocket launcher for uh, Savage Divide. Or your or your, or your horror base. Wait, no, I don't want a rocket launcher. That'll fucking blow everything up. Aww. Rocket launcher's fun for, like, tier six stuff. But it's definitely... Well, actually, you'll, you'll blow up the loot, too. So, <laughs> you have to be careful with it. Yeah. I can only make a tier one, though. At tier six, it'll be really nice. I, I want to go drop bombs down like a hole during the horde night. I think that'd be fun. I mean, stack stock stockpiling them. Magazine extender. Ooh. Oh, can I get an extender on the on the assault rifle? No way. Oh, I can. That's awesome. I love extended mags. Okay, there's a respec in the box if you need it.
All right, if we're doing Dungeon Boring, we need to get on there. Dungeon Boring, all right. Yeah, it's already nine. Oh, damn it. Count Dankula got smart with his fucking in-video advertisements. Mm. You know, when streamer or YouTubers start, like, to fucking reading off their advertisements, usually it's a pre-recorded bit. What I do is I look for their shirt, and as soon as I see his shirt change back to what it used to be, I'm like, there's the end. Motherfucker's wearing the same shirt in this video as he did for his ad. See, I have to listen to the damn commercials. I don't have to, but I do do it. Mm. No, you just skip in the video. Like, yeah. it's not an ad block thing. It's you literally just move the video forward. Yeah, but remember, if I'm recording and streaming and I'm using someone else's content, I probably should listen to the ad because I'm essentially stealing their content, you know? I, I don't know about that, but I, I guess be more on what YouTube says. Yeah, you can. I mean, streamers care. They're, you, most streamers are okay with you, you know, using their stuff, but, but not skipping the ad. Oh, uh, dungeon boring, right? Uh, oh, I lo I loaded it. I did I load it? Yes, I did. Why isn't it loaded? Oh, it is. There it is. You hid it from me. Ooh, I'm gonna chop some people. Chop, 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 chop. <laughs> this mimic picture is so funny. <laughs> this mimic going crazy, like going gorilla mode on three dudes. <laughs> Fucking funny. Daily quest. Open ten chests using an elf. Nope. Open ten chests using an undead. Nope. Kill thirty monsters. Uh, that won't work. I can reroll. You can reroll one of them. Uh -huh. We're in a competitive I, game. I've got escape once. I've got escape twice, and I've got I need to get two hundred more damage on a player. Oh, thank you. So if we just get out of get out of the thing twice, I'll probably get me through it. Yep, you got a queue. I'll just ready up here. Uh, I believe I'm ready. Um, are we doing uh, TD3? I was thinking we'll do Sinners on Casual. Alright then. That's the harder one, right? No, well, oh, it's the harder like dungeon, the but on the easy difficulty. Ah, uh, okay. You ready up? Alright. Gotta change my title. Dungeon Born featuring Bagon. Dungeon Born Duo. Yeah. Well, let's see if it's a busy night or not. Two out of twelve, two minutes to go. 4,000 viewers, not bad for a free game. Okay. I haven't had to pay anything so far. Okay, uh, it's some kind of mage and a warrior or fighter. I kind of remember the. Oh, we got four people. We have, yeah, we have a duo in here already. Oh, it's a pyromancer, it looks. Well, or maybe it's a druid. I, I don't fucking know. It's a human wizard looking thing. Could even be a cleric, as far as I know. My abilities are not firing. Oh, sick players now. Because you don't get abilities. Let's see, what are you? You have a crappy shield, you have nice plate armor. He has, uh, what's in his offhand? It's like a, a barbiche. No, no, it's just a, a two a, a fly hander. Oh, eight players. This is gonna be a busy map. It is, we're gonna get our ass beat by somebody. Not necessarily, but a, a chance. Oh, yeah. uh, here's a double caster group. Oh my god, I'm gonna chop these guys. I think I, I have an AOE. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, I saw eight players listed, Let's so go. give me a out of 12. That's still going to be kind of crowded, though. Feels like Fortnite. 
fuck Fortnite. Nope, I love Fortnite. I got four wins last night. Four wins on two bottles of wine. Two bottles. And I still got four fucking wins in, in squad. I love oh, great. Fortnite. Don't you talk about my love. Up. I love my Fortnite. I'll oh, make Fortnite. you love Fortnite, too. No, you won't. Your kids will make you love Fortnite. No, they won't. Yes, they will. Nope. No Fortnite for the kids? Fuck that noise. Oldest one's autistic, and my little girl is itty bitty. And there's, there's not even the chance of Fortnite in their future. Skelly, my mouse is not working, and I believe I will have to. Ooh. Did I hit you? I had a frame rate loss. I, I get temporary invisibility over here. I need a. Over here, over here, over here. Watch the trap. Yeah, I get. Invisibility when I score. Oh, what the fuck, dude? Oh, did I hit you? I'm sorry. Yeah, you smashed I was me not aiming at you. I didn't mean to. It's very nice getting this invisibility whenever I kill something. I need to fix some. Um, I need to restart my mouse program because this my mouse for mouse fiber not working. One second. Re Relaunching. Hopefully, it should be fixed like right away. It usually is. This mouse isn't out of battery, is it? It better not be. Oh. You have aggro I'm coming? I can't use my abilities. Not aggro anymore. Maybe I better re re uh, respec these keys. Oh, there's a goblin shaman down the way. I can't spin, so I'll have to rebind these. What is happening here? Can I swing? Yeah, I can swing. But why won't my mouse keys work in this game? Fuck. Are they working in other other things? Oh, come on. Here's casters. Let's just get the gabo. Wait, 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 I don't don't pull yet. Don't pull yet. I've got to change uh, my. You keys. can run in there and, and fuck them up. I can't because I, my keybinds are not working. Hold on, let me rebind. Four mouse four mouse five for. I guess I'll just do two and three. My invis is wearing out soon here. I'd like to hit him. Okay, or not. Why? Dude, oh my what god. the fuck? Did I kill you? Oh my god. I don't know. Now, okay, now it's got some. I've got some problem with my keyboard. Hold on. So, okay, mouse 4 and mouse 5 are working. I think this game is glitched on me or something. And I'll rebind the keys, but hold on, but, but like it messed up, and I'm sorry I hit you. It's not on purpose, buddy. I really didn't do it on purpose. It's my key. I have a key problem. Uh, skill one, skill two. No, it can't see my mouse keys for some reason. Okay, well, I don't know what to do. Um, I guess I'll bind to like T and Y. Some kind of problem with the game. Okay. And I'm, I'm so sorry. Do you want some meds? They want you to run in there and kill the goblins. Okay, I'm going to go in. Sorry that took so long. Uh, what are my keys? They are Y and T. Okay, so T is the spin. They're going in. Nice. Okay, so sorry, just technical difficulties. I didn't have any problem last time. I don't know. Ooh, golden lion statue. I have a thunderclap flask. Give me interest in that. No, I already have three. They are fantastic ranged openers, but yeah, only three. New shield. Ooh, rusty faith necklace and an incense flask. Oh, here's a drop down. Bunch of bugs. Over here. The 
just looting site. Yeah, see, I don't actually skeletons when I'm invisible. Oh, chest back here. What is that? Something up top. It's uh, oh, it's a trap. It's a trap. We're fine. Pendulum trap. Uh, new helm. No, I don't need it. So. Uh, there's a dagger in here for you. Iron dagger. Um, call you. Oh wait, this is the wrong way. We need to go the right way. Oh, forget about that. Whatever, fuck that chest. I don't care about it. It was for me anyways. Oh shit, what's the trap? Am I walking into it? No. I got the last one if you want it. Bats. I hate them. I hate them. This is so fun. Uh, rusted ring of dex in here. I, I don't rock. need your gray items. Just loot them. Uh, I don't know if you wanted to vend her a ring. Then you can vend her a ring. Ooh, horn. Nice. What's through here? Okay. It is a Goblin boss spot oh, up yep. here. Oh, uh, he's Skelly coming in. He's a ranger. Ranger. Alright, yeah, if you can spin them, get go and spin it. to get a backstab on that guy. Ranger. I got blocked. Him. Nice. Thank you. Okay, we got the whole caster pack. How long is your cooldown on that spin? Uh, There's seconds. an eye. Let, let's kill the eye here. Okay, I, I'm coming in 10 seconds. I'm getting a bandage off. I'm low. There we go. And, and, and a potion. No, 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 I'm not. No, I'm not. Okay, go, 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 go. Okay, coming in. Okay, ready? Okay, I'm gonna spin. Why would you spin here? I, I, I didn't know that I would miss the eye. We are spinning so on you, killing the goblin. I was not just bad. trying to do damage to something. Oh, what was that? Oh, not good. Oh. Okay. You're almost dead. Definitely get medded back up. Uh -huh. And don't pull those goblins in the top. Uh -huh. Oh, there's a nice two-hand sword in the skelly behind me. Ooh. Here's another one-hander sword. Is that better? Yeah, it is. Okay, yeah. got a new one-hander sword. Get that two-hander. Uh, which body is it? Is it the green? The only one that's glowing. Okay. Thank you. Oh, I have a green sword. That doesn't matter. It's still good loot to turn into heirloom shit. I dropped something here if you have room. Oh, that's a trap. Watch right. the trap. When, you're, when your spin's up, you need to get over here and spin the goblins. Okay. Oh, just one more ranger. And he's down. Blue two hand sword. Yeah. Speaking my language. Yeah. Good shit, good shit. 
Now we might stand a chance against these casters. Something's aggroing in the background. There might be players nearby. Yeah, I'm just getting the sword in my inventory here. I dro I'm dropping a pair of... Oh, no. Keep an eye out for players. Uh, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm full health. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm, I'm here with you. It, we're still well in the safe zone right now, so... How are you doing on loot? Are you mostly full? I am. No, I have worthless grays and I'm dropping here, but uh, I have about a quarter of an inventory up empty. Oh, I'm coming. I'm sorry. I don't need your help with the basic skelly. I can two-shot him. I was just yeah, have my nose in inventory. Oh, yeah, there's the skellies in the lower pit. We should maybe oh, go he's after them. Oh, well, you spun him last time and killed him just fine. We just need to pull him to the door. Oh, plate gloves in this chest. Okay, no, I, but what I'm looking at is there's people dying. There's portals popping. We're kind of around the center of where it's going to close down to. I think we should basically let's kill the skellies in the hole up in a hidey hole and wait for more portals to show up. We're skellies in the hidey hole. Okay, I'm just walking around the body. That's kind of what I'm thinking just because we have a good loot right now. I have a smoke screen flax if you have any interest in that. Only interest is in you coming here. Yeah, but, I mean, I've got loot here. Okay. Oh, did you loot the center chest? Wait, oh, uh... No, I don't want that. So, and then I'm gonna drop this orb. Okay, I'm finally ready. Oh, wait, are these pants good for you? They are, uh, leather. Here, I have a pair of pants for you. Come, come here. There you go. On the ground here is, safe. is a nice pair of rope pants. And then, um, you ready? Yep, let's go. Nope, not there, not there, not there. Alright, spin me here in the skellies. Okay. The caster's in the back, but try to get on him. Did I hit you? There we no. go. No, you didn't, just barely. But now we've got this clear. Oh, more portals popping, that's good. Yeah, it was a ring. I don't... Let me see. Oh, it's Will. You're not going to want that. Uh, Will's good. He's probably not as good as strength or whatever. Yeah, you should be going primary stat. Remember, because also it unlocks passives and extra abilities oh, when you get your stats. Strength necklace. That's an upgrade for me. Alright, I am literally full. I can't even pick up one slot items. I okay. have a quarter... In we are at the center. Point. There's an escape portal. Why don't you take this portal right now? Alright, Roger. I think you should take it. I can invis. You Let's should see. get the fuck out. Roger, roger. Thank you, sir. Five seconds. Yeah, there's nothing else visible right now. I might have to sit tight till the next message goes out. Oh, yeah, I hear someone else coming. See, I was afraid of that. I was like, oh, no. But you have the tools to deal with it. Uh, potentially. Warrior. Oh, I see a portal. I'm gonna invis oh, them. Oh, nice. That's good. Good luck. Wow, right on top of you. Well, that's what I was thinking. If I there's just hang out here, right behind you. The portals will there's, show. There's like loot in this room. I told you I'm fucking full. Oh yeah. Oh, that was good. We both got looted up we and did. we got out. We got out. Didn't have to fight. Didn't have to, didn't have to fight. I spent, uh, the only, only fuck up is me as usual, sp spin shopping you. <laughs> okay, that one guy was indeed a Frostmancer. Oh, no, he's not, he's not a Frostmancer, he can't. Oh, it's okay. I'm just watching the players that are still up, I kind of want to see what the fuck happens to him. Dungeon. This one guy's in the danger zone and he's going to die. Oh, really? Yeah, as Zan Xander Thegu. He's like deep in the danger zone right now. Somehow I... he's going down as fast as I would expect, though. I don't think there's enough room in the stash. Yeah, he's literally wandering around, like, deep in the die slowly zone, and he's not falling down dead. He must have some kind of health regen item on. Yeah, this guy's straight up ignoring the mechanic and just hiding around in the danger zone. Are you still spectating, or do you take off? Me? Ah, oh, I left because I am slow at loot. Okay. No, I'm, I'm just watching players because it's interesting seeing what they're doing, and I wanted to see how close I was to getting stuck in a PvP match. 
There's still a lot of people up in here. That's kind of crazy. And I keep swapping people, but no one's actually entered that room that we were in. That's really weird. I thought they would definitely show up. All right, I'm, I'm returning to lobby here. I can't hold this mage stuff. I need to sell it. <laughs> There's no room in this damn stash. Maybe this blue staff, I guess. Oh, now I have extra swords, so if we die, I can go back in with green swords and stuff. All right, these. fix your audio so you're not talking in-game oh. and out of game at the same time. Oh, I'm so sorry. That's weird. I didn't know I was. Yeah, you couldn't do it earlier, but now you can. Okay, I fixed it. Sorry about that. That's better. Oh, yeah, my mouse. Uh... Yeah, what's going on here? Like, uh, I think I want to relog this game because I think it's got a bug or something. Because it's working on win, it, um, it's working on Windows, but it's not working on the game. So I'm gonna go relog here. Coming back in. There is a gold rush or something. Oh, they have Twitch drops. Sweet. Okay, so did you load? Yeah, you did. Um, okay, in, will you invite me? You're still in party. You're just oh, disconnected. Nice. Okay, I'm back in, and now I want to see if I can rebuy my keys. Uh, this game will not see my mouse 4, mouse 5 anymore. What is that about? Okay, well I rebound them. I'm I'm all set for uh, if you if, if we're going back in. Oh, the potions don't have sell value. That's dumb. Give me 10 gold or something. Oh, this blue sword has shadow damage. Max crit chance. Oh, so while you're looking at a weapon in your inventory, you can see who 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 has touched the weapon, which is kind of cool. It's called the longer, and and it's like an interesting key. You can find out who belong who. Who had the sword before you? That's outside the box. Ready to go? I am. Yep. I'm not in the queue. Uh, let me queue. Okay, I'm ready up. Okay. Yeah, to get my quest update, I need to get one more escape at least. Yeah, I love this game. Oh, I just forgot. Realer. I think I might have forgotten the bank and a lot of my stuff. Yep. Hi. Uh, it's just extra potions and bolts and stuff, but I'd rather bank them than not bank them. I wonder why the game was so inactive yesterday, and now it's actually fairly active. You know, Tuesday to Wednesday. Six out of 12, yeah. Wait, yesterday we were getting just us <laughs> after two minutes timer.
Yeah, I got the Pyro Cryo Master. So we've got a populated game again. Ah, we already got the shrinkage effect. Four minutes until it shrinks, though, so plenty of time. Gabo Shaman. Got him. There's something on the other side of this door. It's a goblin. Oh, Ooh, yeah. Over here, more more gobbles, another shaman. Like you to spin it. Alright. Going in. Oh, I aggro something over here. Ignore him, ignore right him. Go, 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 go. Yeah, sometimes you just need to go. I went when you told me to. Oh, you're like, oh, goblin, goblin. Well, yeah, because why not just kill him as a single target? He's a methane goblin and I can kill him. Good point, that is true. I stole all the loot. Yeah, I let you. Sturdy hose. Uh, rubber hose on the ground. Alright, let's head back towards where we actually need to go. There's the goat boss down below if we feel adventurous. Personally, I'd rather get out of here safely than be adventurous. And yeah, why don't we clear out this area around the goat boss and then not fight the goat? Legs here, good for you. All right, thank you. Took him. Oh, so go ahead. down there, it's over the other goat boss. Yeah. yeah, that's the goat boss. I haven't seen him yet. I've never fought him. I'm a little afraid of finding out how he works when we already have good loot. I'm invisible, they can't see me. I'm scared they'll charge me. I'm gonna go back here and med. I think they de -aggroed. I'm not dying to these. Okay. Back in the action. Uh, that? that was you hitting me.
blue drop. What the hell? Oh, he dropped a crossbow. Nice. Much better than mine, it looks like. Yeah, I'll switch crossbows there. That's good. I wonder if you could just shoot the fucking goat from up here and not have to worry about him. I'm gonna spin. Okay. Are you? Yeah, I just didn't want to get hit, you know? I didn't want to get hit. So I just messed with him. I got him to, you know, fade into the attack. Dude, he has a pair of apprentices bracers for blue gloves. You can take them. You can take them if you want them. Not really for me. No, they aren't. Oh, they're plate. You, you should be oh, taking they're, plate. Wait, they're plate? I thought they were leather. No, they're not plate. They're uh, cloth. They're, they're not cloth. leather. I can't equip them. Yeah, no, so I'll just take it and sell it. Well, you should turn in the heirloom materials. All right. Oh, here's here's a fancy boss type room, and it's got a super chest in it. There might not be a boss. It might just be the platforms and all that make the chest hard to get to. What was that? Oh, there's an eye in the top left. Yeah, that's you running away from the skeleton. I need your tank. I know. I know. I'm switching weapons. Hold on. around the corner up there so if we if you run out you could aggro him watch it I don't know what the deal is with it it's possible I'm with you oh what was that oh nice there's a mosquito did you kill it yeah you did there's no jump I can kill these skellies by ranging. see where I am. I don't think they, they can see you. Oh, nice. We can't open the chest. And nothing worthwhile in it. That's a shame. I kind of like the idea of hiding up here until the fucking map starts closing, honestly. That looks like it might be a resurrection shrine right there, too. Yeah. Yeah, get up there, go get him, guy. Him, don't you? Oh, go up and get him? Okay. Yeah, get his aggro. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go, go spin. Where is he? Okay, he's right there. There you go. It's like, why am I not getting the backstabs? Thankfully, those eyes have fucking no HP. Oh, there's a giant drop down here, so these even have escapes. This is a really cool place to hide, honestly. Like your danker spot, yeah. I think you have to go get the shrine, right? You have to actually go get the shrine buff in case you die, don't you? I don't know how it works. I don't, I don't know. I thought it would maybe return your party member to life if he hasn't left the game yet. It's a activate resurrection stone. And there's no information, so I don't know. I don't... Like, should I just leave it? Probably. Yeah, just leave it. Because I remember I, I pulled a resurrection thing and it was like a buff that I carried around. But I don't know. Oh, I, I didn't loot the skeleton. Or maybe that's you, actually. No, it's a skelly. Oh, God. What? Ooh. It's a player, player, player. It's a, it's a rogue, rogue, rogue. 
I don't know if I can get down either. I'm dead. I, I, I got wedged. Oh. I got wedged on a chest. I didn't even just wall, wall me in and I couldn't move anymore. Oh, damn it. Yeah. I but I countered the rogue. He only did 50% to me. I actually countered him. I blocked him. Skeleton. Oh, this one doesn't like to turn his back to me. No, look at it. It's so annoying. He looks so cool. Oh, I wish I was here fighting. Players out there. I know. Oh, there's a player. Stealth up in the go right past him. Except he'll be able to. Oh no, that was a skeleton. Yeah, it was a skeleton. Oops. Well, kill him. Wait, am I actually no, I stuck know. in here? Are you stuck in there? Oh no, there's a lever to oh, open it up. Yeah, the only way in here is the drop that I did to get down. How did the warrior reach me? What the fuck? God damn it, dude. That motherfucker was searching for me this whole time. Oh my god, these guys are so bad. He's gotta be mostly dead, too, because he just popped that shit on me. Oh god, how are you gonna get out of this? Fucking hell, I must have had him so close. Nice try. Oh no, not really. 39%. Yeah, but that, it was a 1v2. No, that was a 1v1. It was a 1v2? You didn't see the warrior? Yeah, that was two people, buddy. It wasn't a warrior there hitting the me. Same, you, you, no, the, no, the rogue caught you in the corner, but the, the warrior was around the corner. He came. But the warrior didn't attack me. No, he didn't. He let the rogue do all of it. On the bright side, I got one of my daily quests done. <laughs> I also just lost all my fucking gear. Yeah, I, I have been opened on by a rogue now, and I've seen what it is like, and I countered him for half the damage. I actually blocked him. It was sweet. Oh, well, especially sucks, because I, I had green items, and I even had two epics I bought. Me they too. were cheap, mind you, but... Yep. They were still nice items to have, and I'm sad to lose them. Me too, I'm going to put a new two-hander on. Green sword and green one hander. Oh, it's just rusted. Do we go back in or do we stop? What time is it? It is 9:40. We got a little yeah, bit of time. Yeah, it's late enough. I was kind of thinking stop here. Stop here. Okay. Yeah, I gotta put new potions and shit on my bars. That sucks. It does. Well, if I could have seen it coming, I would have done something. Well, yeah, the problem was you were goofing around when, like, there were a lot of players in there. <laughs> it was yeah. a bad time to be goofing. I, well, I went to go look at the activate stone, you know. Alright, there we go, new daggers. I have 7,000 gold now. Which is pretty good.
Good game. I surprised the shit out of him when I blocked him. <laughs> he just ran. Full blown ran. The minute I blocked him, he just full blown ran. Did not give me a chance. And then the warrior was on me instantly. Yep. That sucked. Oh, wow, there's fucking legendary items for sale. Mm. And people want, like, tw two million gold? What the fuck? Uh. And someone plays way too much if they have that much. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, what's the, what's the size of the party in this? Is it four? Five? I think it's only three. Three. Oh, it's only a trio game? Okay. So yeah, like yeah, I guess this, I mean a successful trio with a healer and a tank and you know a rogue or a mage, they could be farming loot all day, just steamrolling people. Half the engagements you get in are probably solo and duos, so you just steamwreck them. I think he was really mad I blocked him. He just ditched immediately. He knew what it was going to be. Spin shop, bitch. <laughs> Felt like a victim of a drive-by. Oh, the merchant had 20 free cloudy life essence. Oh, Flask of Shielding, Fagon. You need to be yeah. definitely well, popping those. I didn't know the I was going to figure out where I was either, keep yeah. in mind. Yeah, yeah. He had sound ping, so he had plenty of hints. Uh, he obviously knew the map well enough to figure it out. Those guys were pro, I think. Not pro. Yeah, they, they definitely played a bit. Yeah. I was surprised I got so many stabs on him, and he still had like six or 30% of his health. I just blew like 50,000 gold getting <laughs> myself almost full epic gear. Nice. Not all of it's good rolls, but it's it's definitely nice gear. Ooh, and I have just enough dexterity for feather float, which is nice. Entering stealth increases movement speed by 200%. And I also get stealth whenever I kill something. How long? Like five seconds? It's five seconds for the the speed increase, but the stealth is a straight up stealth, so it's thirty seconds unless if I loot something. Hmm. Yeah, if I had more strength, there's some pretty neat stuff I get with strength. Yeah, I like how they, they made you diversify your shit if you want to get good stuff. Yeah. Like there's one bonus fight enough constitution or stamina, it would activate petrifying potion. Or poison, sorry, whenever I stealth. That's the one that turns you into a stone block for like t 15 seconds. Yeah. So like I kill something and then I, I go stealthy and then I can disable somebody again. Yep. But anyway, uh, it's been nice playing with you. I yep, should go to bed here. I'm going to log buddy. off. Sleep well. Yeah, good night. Good to see you. Okay. Uh, Got to go place auctions now. And I have uh, finished up my Dungeon Born session. This is a great game. I, I, I'm on, you know, I, I don't join Discords. So, um, so there we go. Get rid of you. What happened to this? It was the game was not letting me buy Mouse Born Mouse Buy. Are you acting up? How can I verify? Uh, I guess, oh, oh, yeah, you know, 
it, it occurred to me that maybe there is a problem. Let's go. Let's go see. No, no, you're fine. Oh, no. You know what it is. You can't spam that game. They won't let you. They've got like an anti-spam thing. Harris Walls. Oh yeah. Eight sleep makes. Oops, sorry. Uh, thank you, David Pacman Show. I'd like to sub to your channel. It's a product that is amazing, which I love. It's called the Pod, and it fits around your existing mattress and cools down your bed so you can sleep better. They just released the newest model called the Pod 4 Ultra, which in addition to cooling down or heating up your bed can even lift up your head when you're snoring so you can breathe better. It's incredible. To get $350 off, go to 8sleep.com slash Pacman and use code Pacman. The link is Pac in the description. Damn it, Pacman. There is a new <laughs> energy among the Democratic Party today. Kamala Harris and her new running mate, Minnesota Governor Tim Walz, holding an explosive rally in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. Okay, so I'm going to take a small two-minute break here. I'm going to commence drinking. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to drink some wine and uh, and I'm gonna enjoy my evening. I'll be right back. I'm just gonna go. I'm gonna have a bite to eat, like uh, something, and then. Oh God, I hope my mouse isn't fucked up. You know, but I don't think it is. I think it's an entire box. Actually. 